So just to, uh, uh, I have understood and I just wanted to re-confirm uh, with you, uh, what you're saying is just like in a periodic table, we got elements uh, and we combine, let's say, hydrogen and oxygen and, and we create a compound called S2O, which is a water. So depending on the problem and the characteristics of the solution, you need a compound and then you must know which primitives to combine. Uh, which uh, enterprise primitive elements to combine to create the necessary enterprise com composite. Is that correct? Uh, absolutely true. So, so if you have some data objects and you have some process objects and you have some location objects and you have some r responsibility objects and some time event or timing objects and some can rule kind of objects, you can create a BPMN model. That is an implementation. But if you don't de 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 develop that BPMN model from the normalized primitive components of the ontology, the Zachman framework, you have a BPMN model that is only good for a point in time. The moment you couple the primitive components together into an implementation, it's fixed. It's no longer changeable. And those of us who have been around the information systems community for, any, for a long period of time, we know this issue because we used to talk about late binding. You don't want to bind elements together until you click your mouse, actually, because this moment you bind it together, you lose flexibility. So therefore, the moment you bind it together, like a BPMN model is bound together, it is not flexible. You can't change the data components, you can't change the processes, you can't change, can't change anything. And the closer you get to instantiation or implementation, the more complicated the problem becomes. So just so, uh, let me uh, uh, see if I have understood. So take example like if I have a business process model uh, using BPM annotation. So the entire so a business process uh, model with uh, activities and rules um, and, and data store data object represented in a single process diagram. This process diagram is not a primitive. Yes, correct. This is a composite because you, we have uh, activities which are basically doing some transformation. Uh, you got some data object, data store, which are basically some uh, inventory stuff. You got some uh, decision uh, gateways, which are basically coming from the motivation rules. So you're saying you cannot take this composite model and put into the row two, column two in the framework cell because it's a composite. That is exactly correct. But the, the a real tragedy. The, so, uh, the real tragedy is yeah, please go ahead. The, the many, many, uh, many of the tool vendors can download a graphic copy of my framework and put it in the in their tool, and then they map their meta model against that tool. And if their process meta model includes data objects, process objects, the uh, uh, event objects, location objects, and so on, if it's a BPMN notation, they will put they, they will classify their meta model in my column two frame uh, row two which is a process model but that is not a process that is a compound a composite that's an implementation right. so bpmn models do not go in column two row two oh that's interesting i mean uh, that that's a that's an it's I, I, I remember John uh, and you, if you want to share uh, one of the experience about it in one of the workshop a uh, lady using the tool and um, uh, do, do you remember that do you, do you want to share that well th this young lady was sitting right in front of me and I was try I was showing the her at uh, the class I was showing them samples uh, of the models that go in every cell. And when I showed her the process model, which only includes processes and inputs and outputs, it's input, process, output, process, input, process, output, it could be an, any number of processes in the model, but all that's in there are processes and inputs and outputs. And she said to me, no, no, that's incorrect. I said, incorrect? What do you mean it's incorrect? She, she said, she's well. She's telling you that what you're telling me. Yeah. Okay. What yeah, right. So she was saying, well, let's, well, she said, well, when I, in this tool that I use, when I click on your column two, row two, I get a BPMN model. Uh. Well, well, I said, well, who told you that was correct? Well, the people who build the tool say that they support the Zachman framework. Uh. And, of course, I, I got a little emotional. I said, wait a minute. 
You know, they didn't ask me whether they support the Zachman framework or not, and they have they have compounds associated with primitive cells. It, the composite, you, you create the composite by reusing more than one primitive to create the composite. You, know, you don't classify composites. L let me explain this. You do not classify compounds in the periodic table. It won't work. Okay. You can't do it. Right. You classify elements in the periodic table, not compounds. Right. So what you're saying is that... Forgive uh, me. No, that, I'm getting emotional. Forgive uh, me. You know, just to uh, rephrase what you're saying is that the periodic table uh, is a classification of elements and the resulting compounds, you don't put them back inside the periodic table, but they are outside the, 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 the boundaries of periodic table. Similarly, your enterprise uh, uh, com uh, compounds cannot be inside your framework. They have to be outside uh, the framework schema. Is that correct? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, cor correct. The, the compound is, a, is, is a made up of multiple primitive components. And that creates the implementation of the instantiation. The, the primitive components are is, uh, are independent variables. They stand alone, and they are different. Every one of them is different. The, the my framework, being an ontology, it's normalized. You can only put one thing, one kind of thing, in a, any one cell. You cannot have more than one thing in the cell. That's it's got to be one and only one thing. Right. And, and if you want to do engineering, if you have, you're trying to do analysis with apples and oranges. You have, you know things that don't belong on the same list, it's gonna, you, will, uh, you will draw erroneous conclusions. There will be, it will be a, default, a, a defective analysis.